We just launched a game at Mahjong time. In this special strategy theory session, just for obsessed tier members, we're going to be playing American Mahjong at Mahjong time. If you've not tried playing here yet, look for my email in the video description below. Send me an email. I can send you information on their 30-day VIP trial. Let's go full screen and play these tiles. We have one, two, five, eight, nine, pair one, pong five. So let's focus on the five primarily. One, okay, so let's let eight, three go. So I am thinking one, five, maybe odds if we get filler tiles. Right now, it's not looking strong. It looks pretty weak at the moment. Okay, so we do have odd potential in here. If we can get a three bam and a seven, I'd go for the one suit odd hand. Number one, odds number one, dash one. What do you guys think? Is that what you would play? We do have five, five. We sent away a four there. Really the three bam would be, oh, look at what we got. All right, well, maybe we'll get a, maybe we'll get a three bam. Okay, so let's let the two go and then uh, break up the wins. How about two seven? We'll pass two seven and it would be really nice to get a three bam. I suppose if we get a six bam, we could streamline. We could streamline and play consecutive run. We could maybe play big odds if we get a flower. Sometimes you might get a flower during the Charleston. It's pretty rare though. Okay, East, three, one. Let's see if we can get a keeper in this second round. Maybe somebody changed their hand. Second round, sometimes you get fresh tiles. Not this time. We still have two more passes. That was our pass a bit ago. So right now we're looking at odds, but we might try to streamline if we can get a six. I was a little late on that. Sorry, I can't reach my sound. Oh my goodness, we got a pair of twos. Well, okay. Uh, thank you, I guess. Okay, so let's pass five west. We have to make a choice. We have no three. One, two, five, five, seven, nine. Let's let the eight go. Because now if we get a three, four, we could play one through five of some kind with a pung of five. So I'm not sure about that two bam. Okay, we don't need any of these. Oh, let's see what our opponent wants. Okay, I think we're gonna be we're gonna be an underdog on this one. Okay, three. We can do three. Let's see if we can get a couple of tiles here. No keepers. Okay, so we are going to be an underdog. Let's let the winds go. South wind. So we have one, two, five, West seven, wind. nine. One, two, five, seven, nine. I wish those twos were threes. East wind. Because then we could play the odd hand. West wind. We don't need winds. Look East at wind. all the winds are going down. North wind. Interesting. Nine characters. Okay, three band would be nice. Uh, white dragon. West wind. Well, we let a One five crack go during the Charles. We're not taking that. There is, let's see. Oh, sh let's see. I was thinking about the five, seven, nine, nine hand with opposite dragons. It would be the fifth hand down under odds. We're not, I don't think we should take that. We would pong. That's not helpful. One character. Okay, now here's a joker. 
we could define that as a three. Three bamboo. There goes the three. Shoot. A character. All right. Well, technically, we have Joker B with our two. We have the pairs of ones and nines. So it's just going to be a matter of getting the three. I think we should play Sound the odd win. hand. So if a five bam One or seven character. bam go down, I think we should call. We do have a gap, though. Two so characters. it's going to be very risky until we get that three or more jokers another joker and i would define it as a three to fill white dragon pair now let's use it as joker bait seven characters maybe we can we can have some joker One bait character. there we need to draw well we can call Two both our Okay, we don't need that. And it looks it looked like there was a bit of a delay, not much. Six bamboos. Okay, flower. Let's let the twos go. Two bamboos. If we were to get a green dragon, we could maybe Seven switch characters. to the odd hand with dragons and a pair of flowers. Two dots. Let's see here. That would be the fourth hand down under odds. Fourth hand down on the right. Three dots. Pung. We would need a green dragon and a seven bam. Green dragon. There goes the green. Oh my gosh. Okay. Flower. Oh boy. We'll pass. Three dot. It's right there. Pure pung. Might as well two hold bamboos. it. Two bamboos. We're in the middle game. The middle of the middle game in two more picks. Four dots. And right now we have two discards plus Green joker dragon. bait so in two more picks we'll let a white dragon Flower. go we'll pass three crack uh let's let that go three characters we have a three dot pair they could Home. be doing oh there's another three interesting this two might be characters. why we can't get a three bam so we have a three crack pair Let's see. Six Somebody characters. could be playing a three six nine hand Eight or dots. or little odds. Twos are a few twos are down. A few ones are down also. Red dragon. So I'm thinking that these people are not playing little odds. One character. So either three, four, five. Four characters. Three, four, five, or Maybe three six nine. I see a nine crack and a nine bam out. Red dragon. I see a six bam and a six crack out and a three bam. So there's just a little three bit bamboos. of three six nine out there. There goes our tile. Nine characters. Oh boy. Okay, five seven nine. So two three bams are out. Six bamboos. If we can get a Eight green characters. dragon, I would switch to the odd dragon hand white dragon okay let's see if anybody takes it no we don't want to hold three six nine six characters three bamboos oh there goes the third three bam West wind. that's the challenge of playing a gap hand i mean we could use jokers Five but characters. it would be risky Kong. Okay, now there's an odd hand. One, three, Seven three. Dots. One, three, no, that's three, four. Green dragon. Wait a minute, what is, hold on. Okay, six crack, we can let that go. Okay, six five characters. crack Kong with a three, a three dot Pong. So four it's, dots. they're playing Nine the first dots. odd hand. The one we're, we were thinking of, well, we're playing the first one in one suit. I think four they're playing dots. one, three dot five crack kong seven nine in bams so they're going to need these bams this Two is why we, we haven't seen think they're playing odds number one dash two and on Nine our left in. i don't know what they're doing yet i'm kind of thinking consecutive Maybe three, four. Well, if two if characters. it's a three, four, five, six, they're going to be hurting with that five crack there. 
Let's throw the white dragon. White dragon. Okay, so I think what we need to do is define this as a, a 3DM. I, I don't think we have time. Oh, there we go. Oh, they're doing two, three, one, two, three, four, five. Fourth hand down under consecutive run. Well done there. Single pair pung. Oh, and they had, oh, let's see, the three dot pung over there. And then uh, Kongs with jokers. Jokers come in handy for sure. Here we have three, four, five, six, Pung Kong. That's kind of what I was thinking, but I wasn't sure how they were going to swing it with the five cracks over there. And the way they did was a different suit. Over here, we have like numbers with eights. All right. And then our winner there, single pair Pung. That is the fourth hand down under consecutive run. And we tried for one, three, five, seven, nine, and one suit, but our three bams went down, and that was our gap. That's the challenge of playing a gap hand. Gap hand, don't, don't play a gap hand, or try not to. Thank you for subscribing to the Obsessed tier. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give me a thumbs up. Make sure you click the little gray bell. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos, and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next video, may all your picks be keepers.